Hello everybody! In this video, I will review a high-tech rotating Wi-Fi camera by Dahua, model A46P. I will show you all of its functions, how to connect and configure it. If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you will be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. I'd like to present a new product by Dehua company, an IP camera model A46P. This device embodies all the features that used to be available in professional cameras only. In particular, high resolution. This is a 4 megapixel camera supporting 2K resolution, 2688 by 1520 pixels. The Dehua A46P camera can record videos in Full HD or better at 20 frames per second. This product offers one of the highest resolutions for cloud Wi-Fi cameras available in the market. In the end, what you get is a very detailed and high-quality picture. Another special feature is using H.265 codec. It allows to reduce the video act archive size almost twice, while retaining the same good quality of the video. Automated rotation The rotation mechanism of the camera enables its turning 355 degrees horizontally about its axis and 90 degrees vertically. You can see the detailed vision angles on the screen. Another feature to be mentioned is its support for cloud services. All the records made by this camera will be kept in a cloud storage. That is, the video data is saved both to a memory card, which you can insert into the camera, but also to a cloud service. So we can watch it anytime and no matter where you are, as long as you have an internet connection. Using a cloud storage is a fee paying option and it requires you to pay for service packages on a monthly basis. At the same time, it is a very useful function. Even if the camera itself is stolen or broken, you will not worry because you still have all the videos archived in a cloud storage. In addition, designers made this consumer grade surveillance gadget look beautiful enough to decorate any type of interior. If you ever met similar devices before, you might have noticed that this model shares the typical design of other robotized cloud cameras by Dahua. Another special feature is the built-in motion and face detection that gives you more opportunities when it comes to observing an area you are interested in. There is also a special smart tracking mode that makes the camera react automatically to any moving objects. When the motion detector function is activated, the camera will capture the object and follow all of its movements, rotating in order to keep it within its field of vision. Besides, the quality of video recording will not get worse at night, as the camera has a built-in infrared lighting with the active range of 10 meters. Even in complete darkness, the camera will see every object within this distance. As I have mentioned before, the camera features a microSD slot supporting memory cards up to 128GB. This size would be sufficient to store a week's amount of video materials, and it can even suit you for a month. Uh, everything depends on how many moving objects are detected by the camera. This product is designed to operate within 24-7 security systems. Two-way communication is possible thanks to having a built-in microphone and loudspeaker so that you can both hear people and talk to them as long as they are pretty close to the camera. The camera also features an alarm notification service. When the motion detector is triggered, you will get a notification about it to your smartphone. So we can op open the uh, camera app and see what's going on in real-time mode. The device is controlled remotely with a smartphone or PC. In the second part of the video, let's see how the camera works by linking it to a smartphone and checking all of the functions. Inside the box, you can find a user manual in English, describing the steps in linking the camera to a smartphone with a mobile app. 
There is also a power adapter and a power cable and a mounted bracket for attaching the camera to the ceiling. The camera itself is mounted on the platform, and this is where you can see the camera lens. On either side of the lens you can find infrared LEDs that let the camera work at night. The microphone is here, and the loudspeaker is on the side. In the back panel there is an SD card slot and the RJ45 network port for connecting the camera with a LAN cable, as this camera supports both Wi-Fi and cable connection. There are also a 12V power connector and a reset button, which can also be used to configure WPS. Now let's link the camera to a smartphone. To do it, install the IMOU app from Play Market or App Store. When you start the app for the first time, you need to give your email address and a password. After that, a special code will be sent to your email to activate the new account. You will see a list of devices in the main screen. To add the camera, tap the plus button. Scan the QR code, which you can find on the bottom of the camera. Now enter a password for the device and connect the power cable. Connect the camera to your Wi-Fi network. Confirm that the green light is running. The process of connection to the router will begin. You will need to increase your phone volume and bring it closer to the camera's microphone. You will hear a cuckoo sound. When the camera is connected successfully, the app will ask you to set a password for the new device. And that's all, the camera has been added to the list. Tap the play button and the picture from the camera will be sent to the smartphone immediately. In the menu under the video you can enable sound to hear what is happening in the room where the camera is installed. And you can also switch on maximum definition or watch the video stream in full screen. When you activate the joystick, you'll be able to rotate the camera in any direction. You can take a snapshot or enable two-way communication to transmit sound to the camera's speaker or force recording. Now let's have a look at the menu of this camera. You can enable alarm notifications so that your smartphone receives push notifications when the motion detector is activated. This motion detector can be enabled or disabled in ARM settings. And the same applies to smart tracking, which I have mentioned before. Visit schedule settings to set the days and time when the camera should be working. Adjust detection sensitivity. Set detection areas, that is, decide on the areas where the motion detector should become activated and where it shouldn't. In the Cloud Storage tab, enable the function of saving the data to a cloud service. This function requires regular payments. Look at storage status. You will see if there is a necessity in the camera. Set local storage settings, configure video streaming, set higher standard definition, enable continuous recording, turn on customized encryption, enable device share, add users who would share access to the camera, for example, you can add your family members so that they can also see what is going on in the room where the camera is installed. Select time zone, configure the Wi-Fi network. Enable or disable the light indicator, device indicator. Camera image flip. Rotate the camera image by 180 degrees. It's a useful option if the camera is mounted on the ceiling. And the red line, tapping on which you can remove the device. To watch a record, tap the three dots icon in the main screen and select alarm record. Look at the date and time to choose the necessary video from the list and play it. You can skip the video forward or play it faster. 
and download it to your smartphone as well. You can also connect the camera to a computer. To do it, you need to download the IMOU app for PC from the official website. You will find the link in the description under the video. Give your email address and a password to log in. If you have already linked the camera to the smartphone before, you will see your device here, and there is no need to link it again. If you haven't done it yet, click Add device, select connection type, by Wi-Fi with serial number or by the network cable. Alternatively, enable automatic search by clicking Start search. Choose your camera and click Add to current account. The camera should appear in the main screen. The menu features the same elements you have already seen in the mobile app, so there is no point in describing them again. As you can see, everything is pretty easy and you shouldn't have any difficulties. Finally, let's sum it up by listing the camera's pros and cons. Talking of its advantages, here is an important thing to consider. This camera can work even from a power bank of sufficient capacity, as it comes supplied with a suitable power cable. The 4-megapixel camera delivers a high-quality image with good details and definition better than Full HD. the H.265 codec to have more video recordings for the same storage size and lots of smart functions. Now to the disadvantages. No input options for sensors and a siren. You need an account to configure everything you need. Recently many users have been complaining about the poor performance of the mobile app, however, we had no issues while testing it. As you can see, the camera performs exactly as advertised. It is very convenient to be able to watch remotely what is happening in the room and rotate the camera if necessary. The two-way communication feature can also be useful. And that is all for now. I hope this video was interesting for you. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching and good luck.